In this movie, we're going to show how to create an arch molding within Route Software. We're going to start off by creating the arch, and we'll go here to the Draw Arc tool. I'll click a middle point, hold the Shift key, and move the cursor to the right. Then shift, then move it around in 15 degree segments because the Shift key is down, and create a 180 degree sweep section. Now I'm going to take this and hit the F2 key to bring up Precision Input and quickly resize this to 36 inches by 18 inches. I can ex extend the edges here if I want or just create this molding based upon this shape. Next I'll, I'll consider the prof profile I'm going to use and in this case I'm going to import a piece of RB3 molding profile that I have from a previous project and this type of, of profile is easily found on the internet by doing a search for, for uh, molding profiles. Now uh, I'm going to take a look at the width of this part and it's three and a half inches. So I'm going to make a, uh, a outer shape here that's also three and a half inches so that I can extrude this profile along that shape. I'll do that by going to the partial offset tool and creating an offset of 1.75 inches which is half of the total three and a, three and a half inches. I'll collect this, select this line and click to the outside. Then select the new line and click once again to the outside. Now I'm going to extend the middle lines a little bit past the edges using the extend tool and because when I come it's time to setting this profile around I want the outer edge of this part to be on the outside I'm going to select my middle profile here and reverse the direction. Now using the join tool I'm going to close this the shape I was creating and the join cool tool selects one uh, open edge and, and allows you to close it to another open contour, uh, joining them together. So now I have an outer shape that represents the molding I'm going to create, and I'm going to create a 3D relief or a 3D surface in this, uh, surface in this area. I'm going to do that by going to the Create Relief button, and I'll, I'll select a flat relief here and a resolution of 100, and choose Apply. Now I've created a flat, no thickness relief in this area, and I'll use the extrusion tool here under Create Surfaces to extrude this profile along this path. The little wizard tells me to select the contour I want to extrude, select the path I want to follow, and now I'm going to hit Add in the bottom middle of this profile that I want to go along this path. I'll hit my check mark and now I've created this piece of molding uh, using the tools here and in route and we can see that this particular profile is sweeping along this whole section. So now I'd be ready to move this into the material, create the toolpath and output it to the machine.